on the show tonight, Captain Jean-Luc Picard, a brilliant comedian, and the star of Taken. Oh, let's get out of here. Walk back to nine. Let's start the show. This evening, Hollywood great Liam Neeson is here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Acting royalty, Sir Patrick Stewart is here. I know, I know. The hilarious Alan Davies is on the show. Everyone loves Alan. And the fantastic Brit nominated singer Ed Sheeran is here. Liam Neeson is here. Now, he's going to be talking... I yeah, yeah, all right. All right, ladies. All right, one at a time. Uh, he's uh, going to be talking about his new film, The Grey. The Grey. Oh, I know. All right, all right, right yes. Just, I'm saying the word grey. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Move. <laughs> his new film, The Grey, all about a group of people trying to survive in the wilds of Alaska. Now, I'm not an expert, Liam, but I'd say, pop a coat on. Uh, <laughs> and then, of course, uh, everyone loved Liam in the hit thriller Taken. <gasps> such, I know, such a good film. Uh, he plays a man whose daughter is kidnapped in Paris. <gasps> Imagine being a father and hearing that your daughter has disappeared. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a daughter. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. In the film, Liam's character has to use his CIA skills to make the French people talk. Not always easy. No. <laughs> uh, <laughs> what's that? She's in a box. <laughs> in the film, uh, Liam's daughter was kept in a tiny room with only a hole in the ground for a toilet. Or, as they call it in France, en suite. <laughs> Mind you, uh, lots of brilliant films have, be, have been set in France, uh, not just Taken. Uh, there was also Midnight in Paris and, of course, The Brilliant War Horse. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get the guests on! <laughs> Later on, we'll hear our music from the wonderful Ed Sheeran! But first, he's better than quite interesting, it's Alan Davis! Ladies' night. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, welcome, all of you. Uh, thank you very much for thank coming. You, Good to be here. Uh, and Liam, you never stop. You've just flown in from Paris. You're filming in Paris. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you're you're making. Is it taken two? Taken two, yeah. Or <laughs> taken two to clean it. Serious? Does she get taken again? You can't say. Okay. Because that would be unfortunate. That you would, would think you stupid would really cow. Stupid. What the hell? <laughs> Because <laughs> apparently, uh, like, the student travel people will be furious you're making another one, because didn't it really hurt American students travelling and things, the first well, one? I, 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 it was weird, Graham. I've had so many people come up to me saying, oh, thank, thank you for that film. I'm never going to send my daughter or my son <laughs> to Europe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, it's not that common that you go on your holidays no, and get sold into not. sex slavery. It's it's, not. Yeah, <laughs> St. So Patrick begs well, to differ. <laughs> Every summer. <laughs> and, uh, Sir Patrick, I feel we ought to... Can, uh, can I ask yes. you, uh, Patrick? Oh, okay. Just Patrick. Just Patrick? Yes. It's... it's not... <laughs> it's... it's... It, 
thank you. It's lovely. <laughs> it's lovely, but it, it's not required okay. all the time. OK. Thank you. It may slip out sometimes. <laughs> all right. Oh, you mean the Sir Patrick? Yes, yes. Yeah. yes. <laughs> Nasty <Yeah>. moment. Yes. <laughs> Only later in the show, after 11. We're allowed. <laughs> That's the thing he calls sir, you see. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, sir. <laughs> oh, big tiny sword. <laughs> All right. <laughs> uh, you know, I was going to say, Patrick, that I feel we ought to issue a warning to the pensioners of South London that, in fact, the young Vic has not been changed into a bingo hall. It's the, it's the name of your play, yes. Bingo. But yeah. it must confuse people that I, there's I'm a big sure flashing it, sign saying Bingo. Yeah, I'm sure it has <laughs> over here. But I can't, ex I, I can't explain the title. I've worked out for myself what I think it has in relation to the play, but it, it, it's, a, it's a play about the last days of Shakespeare's life. Yeah. Housey, housey. <laughs> <laughs> And it amuses me the idea of you walking around because you are so recognizable. And uh, I, I love that story. Where you, you were in San Francisco and the people recognized you. <laughs> yeah, um, it, it, it's people occasionally get a little confused. And I was coming down from the top floor and listening to some music. I in thought you were going to say you were coming down in a spaceship. <laughs> <laughs> I was hovering over the corner. You could see me through the porthole. <laughs> I could talk about that if you want to. <laughs> <laughs> There's an alternative to this. I think go, go. Anyway, I get in the elevator and just before the doors close, a <laughs> couple of couple come in. And it's perfectly clear that they've had a drop or two. And uh, <laughs> the, the, the man says, Oh my God! Oh my God! I, I can't believe this. This is Dr. Spock from Star Wars. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you, you see where he was coming from, but every detail was wrong. wrong yeah. <laughs> and his wife said, Honey, no, no, you got it wrong. This is Sir Ben Kingsley. <laughs> <laughs> At which should I have taken most offence? <laughs> you said, you do, It's brother. just Where Ben. <laughs> Now, Liam Neeson, very exciting, new movie. Yeah, yo, yes, yes. <laughs> Talking about a drink taken. <laughs> In this case, it's not necessary. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, no, very exciting, new movie, uh, The Grey, it opens uh, nationwide tonight. Yes, yes. tonight. Yes, tonight. Yeah, now, I've seen it. Did you see it? I yeah. did. Oh, good man. It's very frightening. Yeah, I guess it is. Yeah, I couldn't look yeah. at my dogs the same way. It's... <laughs> <laughs> No, because I thought it was kind of more of a horror, but it's more like a thriller and a... Yeah, it crosses a few genres, you know? And you're not just battling the wolves, you're battling nature. Yeah, battling nature and battling our inner demons and, yeah. and each other. And... Oh, it's interesting, because we're so used to CGI, but lo this is... It's real. This is all real. We, we shot in northeast British Columbia. I don't know if you were ever up there, Patrick. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Minus 30 degrees Fahrenheit the first week. I remember thinking after the first day's shooting, I thought, we're never going to finish this film. The cameras were seizing up, and it was, uh, it was tough. I didn't doubt it for a second. It really it does look incredibly gold. Uh, just before we talk about it more, they've uh, put together a little kind of montage.